Every year, Shein runs some absolutely amazing sales. And this year, they reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to take part in the promotion for their 11-11 big sale. Of course, I said yes. It is all homeware. And let me show you the size of the box I have. This box is massive. It is all homeware. And as I said, Shein has gifted me all these pieces and they gift you a discount code. I will leave links and everything else that you need to know in the description box down in the corner. So do go and check it all out if you're interested in any of these pieces. First, of course, I should say hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Marlene and normally on this channel, I focus on plus size fashion, but I do love myself homeware. I am an absolute Shein addict. So homeware for the 11-11 big sale. Let's get stuck into it. Sheen has a huge section of stationery and they have a big section of notebooks. I love myself a good notebook, so I decided to pick up one this time. I love this one because it has the little number lock on it. Now it is just set for the three zeros to start with, but it did come with the instructions on how to change the lock if that's what you wanted to do. But you just clip it open and voila, you have a gorgeous notebook on the inside. I'm just realizing this notebook can actually be taken out. This is a cover for a notebook. That is so cool. That means that when I'm finished this notebook, I can actually find another A5 one because it's set on the plastic A5, meaning I can find another A5 notebook and literally just replace it into it. That is so cool. It does have the little flaps, a few pockets there for cards as well, and it has the flap on the other side as well. So you can obviously store papers in there as well but you have the flaps for the covers there. That is so cool. It said on the front here, determination is the beginning of success. And that is what I love about this book here, the quotes on the front. It is a gorgeous a faux leather. It feels like such a good quality. I really, really love it. I love the fact that it has a little lock on it. They are very inexpensive, a lot of these diaries. I think this one was less than a tenner. And I'm not really talking about prices as such today. Um, so if you're interested in prices or details or anything, just check the links in the description box, all right? But I really, really love this. And I actually love the fact that it's a cover so I can change the notebook when I finish this one. My next item is going to require some assembling. And I've just like, not only was the box like four knocks to get into, but I opened it up and realized that everything is going to need to be assembled. I am not a person that does assembling things. Um, I leave that to other capable people in my household. This is a gorgeous picture frame and I cannot wait to put it together. It's so gorgeous. It is plastic though. Now that I'm opening it up, I'm seeing that it's literally plastic. I actually thought this was going to be metal. Um, so I'm a little bit disappointed that it is plastic, but I have to say, I love the aesthetic of it because it's all like distressed and vintage looking. I assume it's going to spin very well. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to get, I'll probably ask Emma if she'll put this together for me. She's very good at that sort of stuff. Right, Emma has put this together for me and I do love the look of it. It looks absolutely fantastic. I think I mentioned before that this is plastic and you can already see here now what's happening, which is the best way to show them. Every time, you... so we just leave it at that. Um, unfortunately, this structure is just not sturdy. Can you show it here, sweetie? Look, there's no screw to hold these two parts together there. So that piece just goes in here. There, I don't know if I've shown it properly, but, and then this one goes in there and then it just holds together. But because it's plastic and this is real glass, it's just way too heavy. And this construction is just not sturdy. So it keeps falling apart every time you touch it. And because it's just plastic, it's just no good. Love the look of it, but unfortunately it's just not quality. Okay, the next item does require assembling as well. And that I'm, I'm not fond of assembling things, but basically three pieces for each item. And this just needs screwing together. So I think I can manage this. But this is essentially a candle stick and there is a three oh they're different heights hold on i'll put the last one together there we go i managed these ones this is three candlesticks and they are obviously all looking the same but they are in three different heights so they're gonna look gorgeous standing together these ones are going in my office they're plain and simple and 
they're metal which i really really appreciate they are just plain and simple you can dress them up with some decorations around the stem or just leave them as is that is up to you they are just plain and simple but i really really love them and then they're going to match my office perfectly i love these Next up, I ordered a little rug, and this one is intended to lie underneath my desk, which is kind of right in front of the fireplace down in my office. All these pieces are from my office, and I just, I, I love the aesthetic of this. It is so beautiful. This is like the old-fashioned kind of embroidery. So, so, so pretty. Look, all those dusty kind of vintage colors in it. It is just so pretty. On the back not the most practical items to show here there is like little kind of rubber grips on it little flowers there that's just so it doesn't slip on the floor which i really really appreciate i would say the quality looks to be really really good on this i might just use it right here where i'm instead would that look nice showing off clothes oh it's nice and cozy on the feet oh that's lovely yeah, I don't know where I'm going to put it yet, but I really do love it. The quality is a fab and it looks amazing. As a huge fan of storage boxes, as a huge fan of everything vintage, when I saw this, I had to get it. It is a little storage box, but isn't this just gorgeous? Again, they came in three different sizes. I picked the biggest one. I think this one is the biggest one that, um, that they had. But this is just so beautiful. Again, it's that vintage inspired idea and it's going to look amazing in my office. And I can just hide a few bits and pieces in there. God knows what I'm going to use it for. But I just think it's so pretty. This is a little elastic band that you simply just take around the bead. This is harder than I thought. There we go. And then obviously that is closed and secure. On the stock photo, they had the three of them standing on top of each other. And I did kind of think if I loved it and the quality was good, I might just go and order another one. The lid is kind of on with a little bit of a string there. So we'll see. I don't know. As I say, I don't know what I'm going to use it for yet. I don't know where I'm going to put it, except it's going to be in my office. So we'll see. But I might just go back and order one or two more of these because it's gorgeous. This is one of those things that just because I could, I, I definitely should. This is a little storage basket, but it is made to look like a fairy house. Isn't it just adorable? I have no idea what I'm going to do with this. I have no idea where I'm going to put it, but I love it so much. It reminds me of a little handbag, right? I am in love with this. It is just so cute. It has a button here on the side, just like on the other little basket. So that's an elastic band over the bead. And then you can pull it open like such. It is secured. There's an elastic band in there as well. So the top won't come off completely. But you can obviously open it up and put it in there. But the little door as well, you can actually open the door. Same principle with the elastic band around the bead. And you can open the door. No clue what I'm going to do with this. All I know is that I blooming love it. And I am very, very happy that I now have it in my possession. And then we'll take the rest from there. I love it. Just in case this is your first time visiting, I do normally do plus size fashion here on my channel and I take a lot of photos sharing my outfits. And this is my normal background. This is what I normally take photos up against. And that's fine. I, I it, My bedroom is fine. But because I get these things gifted, I allow myself a bit of luxury and I picked this. This is a photography background or a tapestry as they also call it. Now, because I do what I do, I actually have the big stand where you hang this tapestry on and then I can take the photos. But I thought, because I could, I kind of would. I am a huge book lover and I love, as I said before, I love everything vintage. You bring vintage and books together and Marlene is there, all right? So when I saw this, I just had to have it. I had to have it. It is so beautiful. I don't know what I'm going to, like what outfits I would want to take photos of. Maybe I'll just hang this on my wall somewhere and just have it looking pretty. I don't know. But photography tapestry with vintage books on it. Yeah, it's just up my street. This, I love it. I would say it's polyester, by the way. It's a gorgeous uh, fabric, very soft, but um, loving it, loving it. It's like an early Christmas this year. Oh my God, look at that. I don't remember ordering in the frame with the girl in it, 
but God, I love this. This is really, really heavy. Oh, there's a bit of polystyrene stuck in it. It's not broken or anything. It's just polystyrene. This is going to look amazing in my room. I don't know if I like the girl in it, but I might just put something else in this frame. It is stunning. Look at the detail of this. It is so beautiful. On the back, it does have a stand so it can stand. Can you see it there? But it also has the little hook there so I can get my husband to hang it up for me. That is glass. I think that's glass. Is it? I think that's glass in the front, to be honest with you. This is amazing and it's going to look amazing on my wall. I love this so much. The quality is amazing. This is a package of, oh my God, they're gorgeous. This is a pack of three wooden shells. And these are actually dark wood. Aren't they stunning? Obviously, you screw them in. So this part here goes up against the wall, like such. So you'll see that bit. And there are three of them in the pack. They are the same size, all three of them. But I just love this dark brown color. And this is why I picked them. I didn't know that Jean actually did furniture, if you want to call it like that. I know it's just a little wooden shelf. But I just think these are brilliant. And I have been on the search for exactly shelves like this to go in my office for all of my lego and whatever else i have done there i have a lot of stuff down there but these are fantastic i love them they do come with some screws and stuff not knowing much about diy i have no idea what kind of quality this is my husband that that's his department he will be hanging these up for me but this this is solid wood and I really, really appreciate it. They are absolutely gorgeous. I think I will probably order another pack of these because they are exactly what I want for my Harry Potter room. And if you want to see eventually, and I, I am saying eventually because there's no time frame on it, but if you want to see how I put my room together in the end, keep an eye out on my Facebook page or my TikTok because I'll probably show a little video over there when it's ready. But it, it could be, still be a while, but um, yeah, keep an eye on my social medias if you want to see it coming together. The last piece I have in this massive box, and I actually forgot what it was. This is superb. Keep Harry Potter in mind, right? Because obviously that's what this is all about in my room. But I found this. Isn't it gorgeous? This is, it is actually a candle holder. You can put a little candle in there. I don't know how it's going to look. This I'm not really sure what this is made of. It feels like it's wood, but I would say it's probably more like a resin or something like that. I don't know. So I would be cautious with a candle, but nevertheless, I didn't order to put in the candle. This is going to be standing on one of those wooden shelves in my Harry Potter office. Isn't this gorgeous? Look at the detail of this. It is so, so beautiful. I'm in absolute love with it and it just fits the aesthetic of my Harry Potter office so well. I'm in love with this. It, it's beautiful. I am really, really taken aback about all these things. I genuinely love every single item that I ordered. A huge thank you to Sheen for working with me. And as I said earlier on, discount code links and everything else are in the description box. So you can go and check out all the pieces down there if you're interested in any of them. All right. I will leave you with my playlist for my usual Sheen haul here or here. I can never remember. But if you want to see what else Sheen has on offer in the plus size fashion category, because that's what I normally play with, you can go and watch that playlist. All right. But that's it for today. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.